Election season is nearing the end, but the topics of discussion among local candidates are still highly impertinent to the community. One of these issues plaguing the area is dark stores. The dark stores legislation, which was conceived last fall, recently left the House floor in a 97 to 11 vote. Now it sits in the hands of the Michigan Senate for approval. If the Senate takes it up, I believe we'll get the votes to get it passed. But that's a big if. There are a lot of ramifications. There are a lot of folks looking at higher office on the Senate side that are dependent on the Michigan Chamber. Um, and sometimes they do their bidding instead of doing what's right, in my opinion. Kivala said that it was the public's voice that really helped it get this far. I think it was really that grassroots push with all the different legislators' offices, especially in the Tax Policy Committee. Every one of those committee members heard from people on this issue. I think that's what led to it being taken up on the House floor. The bill in question essentially tells the tax tribunal that they have to handle dark stores cases the same way assessors or appraisers do. This means they would have to utilize three approaches to valuing instead of relying on the sales comparable approach.